So we are back with another Team of the Week player review. It's Team of the Week 4 and it is Bukayo Saka's time to shine. He got, was it two assists and a goal against Southampton at the weekend? And he looks very good and his card also looks fantastic. He's 88 rated, 5 foot 10, 3 star skill moves, 4 star weak foot and he's left footed. It's cost me 185k um, to buy this switch. Looking at the stats, might be worth it, might not be. We'll see soon with this review if he is. He could play right mid or right wing, and obviously he's Premier League, Arsenal and English. Looking at his attributes, 90 acceleration, 85 sprint speed. So he is fast. Shooting has got good finishing, 84 attacking positioning, 86 finishing, 81 shot power, 85 long shots and 89 penalties. Obviously he's left footed playing on a right so he can cut in and get those powered shots or finesse shots into the top corners. Passing as well for a winger, 87 vision, 86 crossing, 84 short passing, and 85 curve with the important stats there. And his best stats are his dribbling. 86 agility, 89 balance, fantastic. 86 reactions, 89 ball control, amazing. The 90 dribbling is just perfect. Defending, he doesn't really defend, so his heading accuracy isn't great. But he could win a few headers with 72 jumping. Amazing stamina, means he can run all game. And his strength is pretty poor, but he's not a very strong player, let's be honest. Um, he falls over and limps most of the time. So, yeah, we'll never know. Um, play styles. I thought it might have a pro um, play style plus, but it doesn't. He has finesse shot. He has whipped pass, flare, and technical dribble. And then if you're interested in the roles, both right mid, inside forward, and right wing, inside forward. So, what we'll do, we'll get into a few games, see how he plays, see if he's worth the 185k. Clips will follow, and your view will be at the end. So, team of the week, Bukayo Saka. For me, the best winger I've used so far on the game. He is incredible. Two games, seven goals, one assist. And this was in Division 2. Yes, I'm a Division 2 player somehow. But he was incredible. Honestly, him as an inside forward, the way he cuts in, he plays like a second striker, which is amazing. He stays wide. But then when he has a chance, he cuts in. His finesse shots are fantastic. His power shots. He's amazing. He's even good at heading. He scored a header for me. Um, good stamina. He can run all game. His pace is amazing. And his finishing, penalties, volleys, long shots, passing, crossing. Everything about him is fantastic. 185k, I think that's quite cheap for him. I think I've, I've used a lot more expensive cards. It's not been as good as this card. Honestly, tomorrow when I open my uh, rewards, I'm hoping I get this card because I want to be in my team. Um, obviously, I'm going to sell him because my... This team is for reviews, so I need the, need the coins. But if I pack him untradeable, 100%, he'll be my starting winger over Rodrigo. Fantastic player. So, honestly, and this is getting filmed at half past nine on Wednesday evening. 
they've just patched the speed boost and the overpowered lofted through balls. Um, it's just been released. Um, so that was without using speed boost with Sa uh, with Saka. So honestly, fantastic. 100%, if you pack this card tomorrow in your rivals rewards, use him, try him out, see how good he is. If you're doing an Arsenal road to glory or Arsenal past and present, try him out. He is fantastic. So that being said, leave a like, subscribe, and more views will be on the way.